me start from the very beginning. Okay, from the very beginning, the origin of man and society. When I say population, oh no, these are not in part of syllabus directly. But you should know these points to appreciate and join the dots together. Okay, so keep, uh, keep with me. The origin of man and human society. Beginnings can also be. Okay, how did man emerge and how did we spread and so on. So, if you know a bit of geological time scale, we say that uh, uh, the most, the most uh, uh, recent uh, developments in Earth's evolution, the most uh, recent development in Earth's evolution uh, that uh, impacted, that impacted the emergence of man and his society begins, begins with the uh, tertiary times. As dekha jayega, the beginnings of man is linked to the beginnings of earth itself. If earth na hota, to man nahi hota. If earth didn't, did not have atmosphere, we would not have man. If earth did not have water, I would not have man. If earth did not have life, I wouldn't have man. That's fine. But I say, if you're talking about the most recent events, the most recent developments in the earth's evolution that impacted the emergence of man and his society, we say begins with the tertiary times. Why? Because this is when we have the evolution of mammals. I assume you all know what are mammals. There are fishes, there are amphibians, there are reptiles, okay, reptiles like dinosaur, reptiles like crocodile, reptiles like lizards, and there are mammals. Mammals, they give birth to the young ones, okay, the mother suckles the baby with the milk, some features of mammals hote hain. So, Tashi times, this began around uh, 60, 65 million years ago. Yahan se mammals ka origin hai.